What up, YouTube? <clears throat> B. Jones back with another reaction video. We are, uh, I'm gonna delve into some Samson. This should be interesting. Birthday bash. I I know it was like, what is this? Uh, August of 2021. So yeah, we're, I'm gonna check this out, see what it is, you know, see what is going on, what's popping. Samson. Please remember to, uh, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. It helps out with the analytics and stuff. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, stop by, uh, stop, stop by this artist's channel. Stop by Samson's channel. Hit that subscribe button. Give him a thumbs up. Let's get into it. <laughs> They're following all the safety precautions. People are going to sporting events that are bigger than this. This is going to be safe. This is a sophisticated vaccinated crowd. And, and this is just about optics. It's not about... What did she say? This is going to be safe. This is a sophisticated vaccinated crowd. And, and this is just about optics. It's not sophisticated vaccinated crowd. Sophisticated. See, look, she's got her eyes closed. She can't even look at the camera because she, you know, she's about safe. <laughs> One hell of a party. I wish I was there. But with all this COVID, I bet you guys were scared. Well, you probably followed every rule with all the activities you did that night. I mean, you probably kept six feet apart the whole time and you only took your mask off for pictures, right? I bet you did. I bet you took every precaution. I bet you stopped the party every 20 minutes just to check everybody's temperature often. I bet you did. I bet everybody had to show the proof of their vax. And if they didn't, then they had to go home because Obama would never approve of this crap. I bet all the servers and caterers had to wear gloves when they served you your fave dessert. I really hope that you paid them first because they were risking their lives celebrating your date of birth. You said that you scaled it back because there's too much at stake. Yeah, I bet you scaled it back because y'all motherfuckers are a bunch of snakes. If I were to get a big group together, the media would put me through the shredder i'd be responsible for everybody's death for the next six months a super spreader but obama don't be stupid never this event was sophisticated this ain't no bean tossed beer chugging bullshit in the backyard listening to a playlist of country music you dumb useless stupid small little measly runts we can party if we damn well please but you <laughs> not even once don't think about it matter of fact it'd be better if you just didn't think at all now shut the fuck up and put your mask on before we have to get more deeply involved we were at <laughs> oh my god Oh, dude, I, I I wish that I hadn't listened or watched any of his other videos. You know, uh, uh, what, 13 equals 46 and, you know, the, yeah. That, this dude is awesome. He is hilarious. Oh, let's... Now shut the f up and put your mask on before we have to get more deeply involved. We were outside, but under a tent. So technically that makes it inside, but it was still outside. You know what I meant. Shut up. Whatever. You're never going to hear the story from us. We'll just have Don Lemon and Chris Cuomo talk about Trump and how horrible he was. The media would take a dump in their britches if they caught wind that the new Republican did this. And that just goes to show the double standards and the hypocrisies when it comes to this instance. Doesn't it just piss you off? What? They come and they cut your small business off. They grip their claws around and constrict till you ain't making shit. Then they tell you to suck it up and limp it off. Yes. Then they skip and hop into their private jets and fly to Barack's Island to thrive and rest. Burning all that fuel into the sky while our fragile climate is in such a dire stretch. With all these dying people packed in the hospitals, I think you should feel it have it responsible you could have probably killed so many friends of yours you just added to the top of the toll that's what you say to me when i walk into kroger maskless why would i follow these rules that you yourself don't even practice perhaps if you stuck to your story we wouldn't be so fucking disorderly you say that it's dangerous and then you do shit like this and that's just what floors me well you're my role model 
You're the one I'm supposed to follow, so I'm gonna call everybody I know and throw a big ass party like there's no tomorrow. The Newsom way, the Obama way, like a Nancy Pelosi spa day. We're gonna rip the mask off and hug each other till we can't hold on any longer. Yay! Yeah. It may not be sophisticated as yours, but I gotta work with what my pay can afford. I'm just taking orders from the people that matter, the powerful ones. This is straight from the source. Thanks, Obama. I get the message. Your actions spoke loud and clear. F the World Health Organization, the CDC, and Fauci. Here's the bottom line. All right. How long are we gonna do this? It's all up to us and it always has been. There really ain't nothing new to it. Our rights are being stripped. All you gotta do is take a look around and it's only gonna get worse from here unless we as a whole put our foot down. It's a big club and you ain't in it. <laughs> oh yeah, Samson. Samson killing it. Oh man, I'm you know, God, I, I'm I'm hoping that you know people don't uh, don't take this the wrong way, but um, I want to put Samson kind of you know not. I'm gonna go with it. I don't care. You can hate me. Hate me in the comments. Not gonna hurt my feelings. Uh, uh, but I, I kind of, uh, I kind of put Samson in the same category as uh, as Tom McDonald. Um, you know, talking about shit that needs to be talked about, that needs to be said. Uh, I think these two would. I think. And I, I honestly think that uh, Tom McDonald and Samson would make a crushing team if they uh, did a uh, did a back and forth uh, together, attacking the system uh, from their own <clears throat> from their own perspective. Uh, so yeah, that's my take on it. Samson, hell of a job, man. Absolutely phenomenal. Um, that shit's funny. That is, that is absolutely hilarious. All right, guys, that's going to, that's going to wrap it up, man. Peace out. Share the love. Peace, peace, peace. That's what I want. I want a piece of pie. Pie sounds good. He had, a, he had a pie sitting there, pizza, but it's still a pie. That's the way I look at it. Anyway, peace out, guys. Share the love. Share the happiness. Have a good one.